The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way. And their opponents at a combined weight of 308. And here we go, folks, as we get this tag team match started. I wonder if we'll see any underhanded tactics from Bobby Fish here tonight. Saxton, you're confusing underhanded tactics with Bobby Fish's natural talent and rugged grit. Wow, what a sequence. A well-aimed strike. Bobby Fish sees in the moment that time. Nice wherewithal. Backdrop suplex. Ooh, just relentless. Not looking good right now. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Big, big back body drop. One elevation. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. It looks to me like he's really trying to carry this team on his back, which really isn't necessary considering he has a very capable partner he could tag in here. Spinning arm breaker. Hoping to make a tag here. And it sounds like there are a lot of people here tonight hoping for the exact same thing. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, the New Day, the Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus, I could be here all day naming championship caliber teams. But when the tag team scene is that competitive, you don't know which team would be wearing the gold. Yeah, this early, no chance. Beautiful standing switch into the dangerous combination of moves from Bobby Fish. Yeah, when he's going like this, no telling how long he'll keep it up.
we've seen so far, you cannot question the lengths these superstars are willing to go. The limits of physical exhaustion. Oh, well, look, Bobby Fish is in position. Uh-oh. There it is. Fish just put the exclamation point on this match. Yeah. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. He ain't messing around. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. Here are your winners, Bobby Fish and Kyle O'Reilly, Undisputed Era. The shoulders were down great. agility, it's difficult for anyone to argue against the moniker. And when it comes to Johnny Gargano, there is something inside of him that makes him near impossible to keep down. The resilient spirit, the never quit, never surrender attitude that makes him Johnny Wrestling. Saxton, I have already explained this. There's a screw loose in Gargano's head. He doesn't know when to stay down. Johnny Gargano refuses to let any superstars in the ring with keep him down. So if you're really going to try to defeat Johnny Wrestling, you have to bring everything you've got and keep on it. Very, very true, Corey. No matter who his opponent is, Gargano refuses to go down without a fight. His opponent has to bring that same kind of fight to even have a chance of coming out on top. He leaves out of the way. And German suplex with the release. Right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. He's executing on his plan perfectly. Yeah, he picked up steam and shows no signs of relenting. Oh, that was 
Shelly. Not the all. Oh, God, that hurt. This is a big risk, will it? Look at this. You know what, Garth? Not this time. An impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here. Reverses. Can he make him pay? Chinlock! Great way to wear it on your opponent. Just getting overwhelmed. Guys, let's go to the replay. Cover here. And an earful. That kick out shows the heart of Johnny Wrestling. He will not quit. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. He's definitely being the aggressor here. Yeah, he's got some magic work, and that's for sure. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. for it all. Whoa! Moonsault! Cover! There's two! No, that may be the closest I've seen a referee's hand come to hitting three. Oh my goodness, crushing it!
That match deserves another look. Here we go. That's what I love about the WWE. A match that lives up to expectations, but still finds a way to surprise us. Good Here stuff. Is your yeah, play it. Here we go. What an incredible matchup. What we just saw is another example of why Gargano is known around the world as Johnny Wrestling. We've got an animated crowd here tonight as we usually do when we're in Orlando. is undisputed. And his opponent representing Undisputed Era. As we hear the sound of the opening bell, Roderick Strong looks as focused as ever. A superstar who lives for competition and more importantly winning. Strong has no problem taking things into the next gear when the time comes. And on the other side of things, there's Matt Riddle, the original bro. A laid back kind of dude with a take no prisoners attitude once the bell rings. You can see it in these superstars' faces. They're in serious pain at the moment. A lot of punishment has been dished out, but no one is thinking about quitting. Bomb planet. Roderick Strong is starting to take control of this match. Whoa, he picked up steam and shows no signs of letting up. Kick right to the leg. That'll sting. Oof, right to the back. Oof, a series of brutal kicks to the body. Oh, what a roundhouse kick. Boom! <laughs> Across the top rope, stun gun. Finds a way to reverse. Boom! Bicycle knee strike. Oh, oh, on the jaw. Whoa, strong able to avoid damage. Corey Roderick Strong is so good in the ring, and it feels like we're only just scratching the surface of how good he is. Is there anything to keep an eye out for? Anything the opponent should have scouted? Well, strong isn't just his name, it's his secret weapon. Roderick Strong is one of the most deceptively strong superstars in all of WWE, so if you're gonna come for him, you better make sure to weaken his back and his legs, and maybe even his arms. Anything you can do to avoid Roderick picking you up and most likely hitting one of his patented backbreakers. Painful attack focused on the chest. Impressive. That'll rearrange 
with the spine. He's looking a little weary now. A change of strategy has to be his next move. Close line over the top rope. All the way to the floor. Landing hard off the back suplex. And again, yet another count. Belly to back suplex coming. No! Oh. This could be it! Huge turning point right here! Talk about impact, Cole. Wow, let's see that. That should do it right there! Victory. Yeah, big win for that young man. And wait a minute. What's he thinking now? He's thinking oh, he's not on. finished. He wants to stop a hole in him. Boy, this match is over. Looks like things just got a little more undisputed. <laughs> the Aussie action hero. With or without undisputed era by his side, Adam Cole always has a trick or two up his sleeve. It should be interesting to see what's in store tonight. And we're here in Orlando, a breeding ground for many of the WWE's top superstars, thanks to the Performance Center. Breeding ground for great commentators, too. And, and there's Saxton. I don't know how you got bred. Drop mm -hmm. kick. Beautiful. Hooks it up. Oh. Insulting. Farms for the second rope. Yo, oh, schoolboy. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. Yeah, this is way too early to be going for the win. Too quick to catch him there. Drop kick. Oh, wow. What a sequence there from Adam Cole. So resourceful. Definitely not where you want to be right now. Down across the knee. That won't just separate your shoulder. That'll divorce it. A high-risk maneuver. Oh, look out. Dummy cross body. Throwing all costs into the wind. Wow, missed by a mile. Had that one well scouted. Well measured. Oh, this is a great move. The oh, shot. Adam Cole is relentless and undisputed. He'd better strike while the iron's hot. Adam Cole looking to end this. Boom, last shot. Just like he envisioned. Uh, this right here is exactly what Adam Cole is. Adam Cole gets the win, baby! A hard fought Welcome, NXT, to Balor Club.
The black card is here. The bell rings and Finn Balor is here to prove that the demon is ready to make it hell on his opponent. And I'd be remiss not to mention Tommaso Ciampa, a man who has probably been obsessing over this match and the damage he's going to inflict from the moment it was announced. Oh, Ciampa and obsession go together hand in hand. Bodies must be writhing in pain right now. The breaking point must be on the horizon. But yet they continue forward, showing no desire to quit. Detonation kick. No one was expecting this. What are his intentions for being out here right now? extraordinary things tonight. Here is your winner, Tommaso Ciampa! He looked very impressive in that win here tonight. They're a club for loose... The head baddie in charge is in the building. <laughs> Mia Yim knows the thing or two about fighting from underneath and clawing her way to the top. She approaches each and every match she's in with that mentality fueling her. And then you have the imposing Shayna Baszler, a fighter through and through, focused, precise, and determined to reach her goals for herself, not for the WWE Universe. And that determination has worked out well for her so far. Yeah, it has. More superstars could learn a thing or two from Baszler about how to approach things in this business. She steers clear there. Bob. Backdrop suplex. What a high angle right across the shoulders. Uh oh. These superstars have been itching to get their hands on each other. And you know what? I've been itching to see it happen. And Shayna Baszler evades that one. with her opponent, but can also become a disadvantage if she's not careful. Her opponent would be smart to use that cockiness to her advantage to bait Yim into making a mistake. It's a risky strategy, though, Corey. Mia Yim can back up her cockiness in that ring, and it won't be easy to keep her off her game. From the top! Big mistake there, Corey. You can say that again. Oh, he's got him up high. Going for the ride. The follow-away slam. Oh. 
strong kick. And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. She's in control. What a sidewalk slam. Hammerlock applied. Oh, no, no. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh, it's going to break their arm. When you talk about great rookie years, Shayna Baszler's first year in NXT has to be in the conversation. She got more done in three months than most competitors do in three years. Oh, oh. man. Inverted backbreaker. Ow. Submission Magician is showing her skill. Looks like she's tapped into some unseen energy source. Wow. Just carrying the opposition here. That offense really hitting her hard. She's not rising to the occasion right now. Putting it all on the line. From the top. Elbow drop. Shayna hooked up. Whoa, over go. Look at this again one more time. Just ragdolling her opponent. Oh, multiple rolling suplex. Is it enough? The cover. You can yeah. take more than that. Shayna looking to close this one out. There it is. Kimura driver. Sits in. Moments away, closing in on a submission win. Another big win perhaps coming for Baszler. Shayna Baszler gets the win. Here comes the EST, gentlemen. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from... The one woman wrecking ball is ready to roll. Never one lacking confidence. Bianca Belair looks poised and ready to compete tonight. Then you have the mosh pit kid, Rhea Ripley, prepped and ready to steamroll her way through the entire women's locker room. Yeah, and she'd do it with a smirk on her face. <laughs> Absolutely, Byron. That's the only way to do it. Oh, Kick man. right to the midsection. This is a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. Power bomb! Whoa, not so fast. She's on the attack and on the move. This is how people end up getting hurt. Oklahoma slam! Oh, nasty impact. Corey, how exactly can an opponent compete against Bianca Belair's impressive athleticism? Well, the EST emanates confidence. If her opponent can prove to be stronger, faster, tougher, or better, for just one second, it's going to shake Belair. It's not going to be easy to make a crack in Belair's ego and disrupt that swagger. Oh, solid contact there. Great technical prowess from Bianca Belair. Looking for more damage here. 
and release back suplex. Elbow drop. From the middle rope. Splash. Massive. And here we go now. Elbow drop. She's starting to tire a little. She needs to turn the tide here. Uh-oh, look at this. So powerful. Oh, foot just stomping down. Showing some quickness. And this match can change that fast. And again, yet another counter. Bianca Belair, big move coming. Wild oh, driver. Turn the lights out. Good night. Absolutely punishing. Take another look, Corey. Shoulders down. One, two, three. Bianca Belair with the victory. Now let's take another look at these wonderful women in action. Look at her go. And here's how she finishes this thing. Here is your winner, Bianca Belair. Big singles win here, guys. That's the kind of win that makes you feel good about yourself. The top.